the closer you are to the camera, the bigger it makes you look. So I need to really like be sitting like Oh way. my God. Oh my God. So many amazing sweets in here. Yeah, I'm so we, jealous. Let's get to we that. have moved. Out. No, you, you get to eat the okay. rest of it after <laughs> the video. You can't. No, we have to move on. Sorry. You can't fill up on <laughs> meat sticks. Seriously, seriously. Exactly. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to the August 2020 edition of Smash the Crate. This is generally the series where my mother and I try every item in the uh, most recent keto crate. But as you can see, I have a special guest because I am actually carnivore for the month of August, meaning that I am getting all of my calories primarily from meat and animal products. Uh, and so these is not meats and animal products, okay? This is actually a, a delicious looking assortment of keto snacks. Uh, and so I have my husband Richard here to give these a try and, and maybe a little different take on these snacks. I am super jealous because this August 2020 Keto Crate was amazing and you have the chance to win this very Keto Crate. Stay tuned to the end of this video and uh, perhaps we'll draw you as a winner. Or if you like don't wanna leave it to chance, cause trust me, I don't think you're gonna wanna leave it to chance. You can use the link in the description box below to get $10 off your very first Keto Crate. And boy, would this be a great one to start with. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're just gonna jump right into it. Um, <laughs> we're going to save the sweet for last. We're gonna save the sweets for last. And that's the thing, we're still going in the order that I would like to try okay, these in. Yeah, so uh, so you still affect. Yeah, exactly. I still have some semblance of participation okay. and control in this whole thing. Okay. Uh, and uh, so normally we will start with the savory items, the items I just want to get out of the way, and we'll work our way to the items where like I'm really looking forward so and hoping sad. that they're good. So sad. I know, right? That I can't have any of them. I am so sad. Well, let's start with the sweets to get those out of the way. No, absolutely I not. So opposite. No, we love sweets. and he loves <laughs> savory. Absolutely not. Okay, so Richard, in case you do or, or don't know, so in here when we judge snacks, mm -hmm. we have a four tier system. Okay? okay, tier number one is our favorite, meaning, whoa, I love this. I would buy this with my own money. Like okay. this is delicious. I'm down, I'm tier down. number two is. This tastes good, and if somebody sent it to me for free or I got it at a meetup for free, yeah, I'd eat that, yeah. Okay. Tier number three is like, eh, if somebody gave this to me, I wouldn't throw it away, like but like, it, yeah, it beats a blank. Like, I, but I'm, it's save, probably save gonna, it for later, exactly, later, it's probably gonna, gonna expire, exactly, <laughs> right? And then tier you. number four is spit it out. Uh, I don't want this. Like, why was this even in the box? Yeah, even if anyone gave this to me, I would refuse it. Okay, I so guess. just know, keep One that in four. mind. Exactly, okay. when we're tasting am, stuff. That down. being said, let's dive into the box, okay? Wee. And of course, you know the first thing we getting out of the way. Oh, well, first of all, we always talk about things we're not going to try. Okay. And in this case, you guys, we're not going to try this uh, collagen peptides. It's unflavored. The purpose of Smash the Crate is to taste the flavor what? of what's in the keto mm -hmm. crate. This that ain't got sense. no flavor, that so we're not going to try it. You know, mix it into your favorite beverage or food, and there's yes. your collagen, yes. right? There you I go. did watch just, the yeah. unboxing. You did? Yes. Good. So you know what yes. we're working with, I so that's exciting. So you know that we finna jump right into this fatty, yeah, okay? I, was, I saw that, I said, Richard is going to yeah, I kept trying to explain to him like what the fatty was. Like Richard, this really looks like oh, a hot dog. Yeah, Look yeah, how yeah. thick that is. That's what she said. I was like, that's what she said. But give that. We know we have to try it. And by we, I mean y'all. But I am a little bummed though because oh this gosh. is a jalapeno flavor. So I was like, of it's course. Like a cigar. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, this thing is huge. And even though technically this is carnivore and I could try it, mm -hmm. I'm also fasting today. So I'm uh -huh. really because I. Really really ain't gonna have nothing. But see, you know? I was wondering when Excuses I was watching on the unboxing and you were out. saying that you weren't alike, but that's considered carnival. No, so why not no thanks. Is. Oh my gosh, I am opening this sucker and I'm- oh. A small piece I don't, for me, please. I don't know how a knife is even gonna get yes. through that. Small piece for me, small so we can have her cut the half small and half. Oh my God, and the amazing thing is, see, you can actually see chunks of jalapeno oh, no. in that. That is amazing. Mm -hmm. Okay. It says it's grass fed. Yeah. I'm loving this. I mean, I'm you're probably going to be the only one, but go for it. Okay, <laughs> go. It's really good. Do you get the jalapeno flavor? Yes. Okay. Oh, I mean, yeah. it's not 
I mean, you see, you get the jalapeno. Yes, I do. I got it. Got okay. It. Yeah, got it. it is hotter than not hot. Okay. It is, <laughs> it is yes. spicy. Yes, okay. Got it. Ooh, got it. Yeah, it's well, that's good. Okay. It's kicking in now a little bit more. Than, I mean, the taste and the consistency is basically like just a really, really big Slim Jim. Yeah, I, I mean, I would not like really that because I don't like regular yeah. size Slim Jims. Okay, so up to you, tier. I, I what that. tier? I would say, I'd say three. Okay, it so you're you're leaving it at the bottom of the it barrel, but third. it'll be there. Got it. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to say, for me, it's a two, close to a one. The only reason I don't like jalapeno. Yeah, I would definitely eat it before the day's up. No. Oh, well, for, okay, all right. Yeah. So I feel no, like that's I a tier like two. Lunch. That's what he said, no. tier two. Didn't he no. said tier three. Well, tier three is when you really want it. Tier two is when it collects dust, right? No. So yeah, the higher the number, like one is a yes. So the two. lower the number, right. yeah. the better. So you the, want a tier two. I thought the lower two. the number, the worse. No, I spent so many minutes <laughs> explaining the tier system. I retract my previous tier, <laughs> and that's a tier two. Tier two. Yay. Okay. Woo. <laughs> Moving on. I mean, <laughs> was it difficult to understand? Okay. okay, so moving on. Now, something I am actually very interested in, like you guys trying, not trying myself, is this Country Archer pork stick, only because the flavor is pineapple. pineapple I, heard. Oh, wow. I mean, this is the very first mm. fruit-flavored meat stick I have ever seen mm. in a keto crate. So I am really, really excited to like see the flavor of uh -oh. this. Here so. we go. Okay, you guys, give it a try. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay. That's not bad. I, I taste mean, the sweet. You yeah, I do. You probably do taste the sweet. You do. Ooh, sweet undertones. But I mean, that's that's an R and B group. <laughs> that's a sweet undertones. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, that's very. That's how it is. Yeah, it's, it's like really subtle. It's, like, it's not like, a bam. I don't know if it's pineapple or just sweet. Just I was gonna say sweet. like if it says pineapple. I want to taste oh, pineapple, right. not not assorted sweet yeah, undertones. I mean, it's, it's more of a sweet than a pineapple. Exactly. But you mm. taste really the sweet. sweetness. But okay, well, see, I would nice probably sweet. like that. I would probably like a sweet it's meat very stick. Mild, very like mild. A, I'd give it a two minus. Mm. Yeah. No. Uh, I mean, it's a meat stick. I'll give it a two. <laughs> <laughs> that is actually, now you get it. Now yeah, you I get, get it. it. Now. Yay. Okay. So the next thing is... I want you guys to try this Primal Kitchen uh, pro mint that. chip protein bar. 200 because, calories? Yeah, for this oh, teeny tiny chip. square. Right. Yeah, it says mint chip Ooh, protein bar. And I know, I want you guys to try it because I think we had a Primal Kitchen bar before. And I don't necessarily know if I liked it. So, oh, I heard you say that. Yeah. You'll be the judge. Yeah, you'll be the judge exactly. of that, depending on what flavor you it was. This has like a very homogenous, like chocolatey texture yeah. that we're used to seeing from these types of bars. So I'm just interested in what you guys think oh, uh, of the flavor. Whoa, I thought it was gonna smush yeah. down like a brownie, yeah. but it crumbles right yeah. apart. So, whoa, okay. okay. Here, Here we, we go. go. Is this uh, a mint? Oh my, oh my God. Crumbly. Mm -hmm. I, I, I can tell. It's <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Oh my God. <laughs> This is what you get the kids to be quiet. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what do we think of the flavor and the texture? Mm, the texture? No. No. <laughs> uh, the, the, the mint oh my is God. just, no. It tastes medicine-y mint. Mm, like medicinally or, yeah, mint. Like, like toothpaste mint. And yeah. honestly, I don't mm. see no chips, first of all. It was oh. all one I consistency. It chips when it, mm. <laughs> chips in your mouth. it chips after, away when you after, bite into it. Aftertaste mm. is not good at all. Oh, wow. Okay, so what are your verdicts? Oh, my gosh. No, that's a um, four for me. I'm sorry. Oh, I mean, my gosh. I wouldn't even want that. If so someone gave it to you, me that is the definition so of I, tier four. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, I would not want that if someone gave it to me. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, no, sorry about that. Yeah, but, uh, no. That's my that's my very first four. Oh kitchen. wow, that's, that's my very amazing. First four. Need to that go was... back to the kitchen on that one. Okay, next we are moving on to a uh, scuda pumpkin seeds. These Scooter. are yeah, these are just or is it, see, I think it's is it if it's scuda, oh, I'm gonna be very embarrassed, but <laughs> I'm calling it scuda. So these are just regular old run of the mill pumpkin seeds, which I think I broke. How you open it? <laughs> we pronounce it Scuda in this household. No. Okay. But if it's Scuda, we're gonna be feeling really really wild. embarrassed. Oh. Exactly. Okay. Well, at least two well, of us. Okay. Oh yes. Okay. I'll show 
Show the camera. Yes. Oh, yeah. These are just pumpkin seeds. Pumpkin seeds. Okay. Yep. You better just toss them back. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Got a straggler. Mm. Got a straggler. Honestly. I yeah. bet they're good. Yeah, I was gonna say, maybe I shouldn't have yeah. ate those after the last one. Because <laughs> <laughs> anything tastes great after that. No, I'm but, like, but, but, water, but no, Scooter actually, pumpkin no, seeds yeah. are good. I've they had those good. before. Mm, they, they, yeah. they actually yes. are very good. I'm I've had those back before. Like, mm, they taste even better. <laughs> <laughs> they're thinner than you think, too. They're really like, Yeah, they're almost like hollow. I was going to say. Yeah. Yeah. Really, mm -hmm. Which makes them easier to shoot. Yeah. I would love it. Oh, good. Excellent. Okay. Oh, tier one, you would purchase those? Ooh. I love it. Like going You're right. hiking or something, and we just had to get we have a bunch of stuff just to mm -hmm. eat along the way. Like this would be a good like trail mix kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, that would be delicious. Oh, sure would. Ooh, but, um, it was like some Lily's chocolate chips. See, now I'm excited. Would, we gotta move go on. Two, okay, tier two, two. That makes yeah. sense. Just because I just wouldn't buy them. But yes. yeah, you have them around. <laughs> okay, next we are moving on to Quavos. I'm mm. excited for you guys to try these. We've had the sour cream and onion uh, version before, right, and they were, you yeah, they were really good. That. But this is dill pickle. Oh, and you guys, can you see how full of air, like how tightly, <laughs> like packed this well, bag is? Like, they they don't, don't, they yeah, because they are very delicate. But I can't. I there's no leeway. I know, right? You can one arm up. I like I mean that could pack an Amazon package. Like, you, you, can put Quavo, <laughs> you can put Quavos oh. around your like Okay, oh, we, okay, we got we got a perforation, yes, yeah. Success. Okay. They definitely designed that. Oh my god, they designed very this bag. dilly. Really like I love it. Ooh, the bag see. is designed to be NASA approved. Yes. <laughs> There we go. This bag can make it to the moon. Here, mom, show it. Yeah, show it to the camera. Oh my god. Yeah, so they are about they are like one and a half by one and a half inch squares, and they're just coated in like a powder dust. It's like a weedable. Yeah, it's like a weedable. <laughs> <laughs> okay, try them. Okay. The Tastes like a weedable. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Hey, I don't know what a weedable is. <laughs> no. I mean, I, I could imagine. Oh, they're pretty good. Dill is strong. Okay. But not overpowering. Okay. Which so is it is okay that it they're called great. dill. Yes. Okay. Oh, yes. I literally didn't remember the deal. It just tastes multi grainy to me. Oh, that's yeah. good. And I, yeah. I would appreciate that on a keto diet. Like, we don't get a lot of multi grain whole. But wait a minute, the deal, the deal is in the, I mean, you can't the smell beginning it. of the flavor. Yeah, yes. Then the multi grain you know comes it? at the end, but yeah. in the beginning. Yes, because the dill yeah. coats it like a powder yeah. and then it fades away. And you can't right. smell it if you know what it is. Exactly. Okay, next we are moving. Now we're moving on to the things that I am excited to try. Like, don't get me wrong, I knew I would like the Quavos and the Scooter and the, yeah, you know. It, oh, okay, <laughs> not so much. Uh, but now we are going to try the Atlas protein bar. I've never had this before, but I mean, I'm just interested to see how you guys feel about this. It's peanut butter and raspberry. Ooh. I know, like it's. I'm, I'm assuming it's supposed to mimic a peanut butter and jelly. So it looks. I can see little pieces of raspberry in the corner. So that is kind of encouraging. Nice. Um, I can see like chunks of peanut. So I am. I imagine that that's good. gonna be good. Crumbly bumbly. Crumb yeah. Exactly. Crumbly bumbly. Okay, give I've it a try. Had a bad experience with the last crumbly. <laughs> You're right. Mm. This is actually really good. Mm. Re that's good. Mm -hmm. I'm so glad you guys enjoyed it. Definitely peanut butter and jelly. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. We are putting this yes. in a baggie yeah. and I'm saving it for September, okay? <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm going to try this bar. I would definitely say two. I would say two. That's exciting. It's really good. I mean, I would say one just because it's always good to find a good, sweet, good tasting keto that is true. snack. Mm -hmm. When you find a good one that's it's all around mm -hmm. and has good texture, parts, right? All parts mm -hmm. of it are good. It's not oh the texture was in, but it tasted good, or it tasted pretty good, but the texture. Mm -hmm. so this yeah. was all around, all aspects of it was very good. Well, that's good. I'm going to try that. Yeah, exactly. Wrap it airtight, okay? That thing is not going stale. Do you hear me? So, okay. Something else I'm excited for you guys to try is the Raw Rev Glow. Uh, this is peanut butter. Uh, this is going to... Oh, creamy, creamy peanut butter and sea salt. This is going to be great. Like, like they are, like, smushy. They're not crumbly at all. Like, they're 
smushy and delicious. I've oh, already had one. Smushy. Spoiler alert! Raw Rib Glow is a swag bag sponsor for Keto Palooza. Ooh, so everyone you. that comes to Keto Palooza is hey, going to get a Raw Rib thank Glow you so bar. Much. So yes, it is like it looks like a log. You remember we did say these look like poops. <laughs> what? Like little poops. The poops. <laughs> they do. Floaters but the, the I'll see, and then I remember oh my, my mom just went on a tangent that I was like, "Why are we talking about this?" Okay, okay, give it a try. And what flavor is this? Again? Creamy peanut butter and sea salt. Okay. I like the texture. Like you could even see the chia seeds mm -hmm. in there. Like I like the seeds and the texture and the flavor. Well, I don't know the flavor. That's delicious. That, but... oh, there you go. Yeah. I mean, it's not. Like strong, overpowering. Mm -hmm. It's very subtle and very delicious. Yeah. It's not really super strong right. flavor, but it's like pleasant. Uh -huh. Right, yes. I was leaning more to three until the aftertaste. Mmm. Now I'm solidly in two. Oh, well, that's good. Look it's at you awesome. guys. Initially, when you eat it, it tastes like just a pro, I mean, the stereotypical protein bar, blah, mm -hmm. blah, blah. But then that aftertaste, mm -hmm. it hits you and you just feel so rustic and like whole grains and you're like, rustic just, you and just whole grains. I mean, I need to give me some good adjectives. <laughs> he is, I mean, he, he is oh in God. the food profession, oh so yeah. 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 I'm That's just why saying, I like, you feel like you like, you like really would, like, you, so. know, you just took a good hike and you got your wonderful food that makes you want to hike. No, but I can this see, see, see now what he did you for see? me. He took me on a hike and I, we had to rest. I needed a snack to get me going. I pulled that out of my backpack, take a bite of that, then I can keep up the heel. We might need to end this early. <laughs> but I see, but that makes so much sense. Y'all get on my nerves. Oh, it does. I agree. Okay, so next we have something else I'm really excited for you guys to try. Yeah. I wish I could try myself in, pa in fact. Um, Monk Pack Keto Granola Bar. This is coconut cocoa chip. Uh -oh. Like we had a Monk Pack bar in a Keto Crate a while ago and I had never heard of Monk Pack and I was like, that's a weird name. And then we had the bar and all I remember was that it was delicious. <laughs> uh, spoiler alert, flavor? Monk Pack is also a sponsor for Keto Palooza. So pack. everyone will be getting a Monk Pack. Yeah, like these are delicious. Do you remember the flavor? The, the one flavor, the one that I got was like sea salt and caramel, or oh, no, I think God. it was like peanut butter, like like a peanut butter granola well, bar. No I mean, if this don't look like a regular it old does. kudos, it like does. granola oh, bar right here though, like it does. looks amazing. I'm so jealous of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> mm. It's probably great. It's probably just a flipping granola bar. Mm. 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 Yeah, hey, I bet I, Monk Pack is delicious. That's a tier one for yeah, me. I mean, that it just seems so delicious. Good. This might be my first one. Mm. Oh, no. oh, he's over this here making purchases, everybody. One making it rain. This is the first one. Oh, of the day. my goodness. That was, that was wonderful. Mm. You taste the coconut, you taste the chocolate. I mean, it literally tells you this as advertised. Yeah. Okay, guys, so next is something that I'm also very excited to try. This is a perfect keto, keto nut butter. The flavor is snickerdoodle. Ooh. Like, I just don't know. Like, I just want to try it, but it's okay. There's always next month, because, like, look how much no. they give you. Yes. I mean, is this is quite a substantial oh portion here, right? Mm. So uh, it says knead and squeeze, so I've been kneading and squeezing, you know, for the past couple minutes i know right okay so i'm gonna open this little tube no. this is so interesting i do like that that's yeah neat. that's very interesting yes. dispense method okay everyone i bought you a spoon and we thank you for okay that. so we're gonna ah! so it the is very liquidy mm -hmm. that's the thing about yeah, these nut butters butter. sometimes they can be liquidy a spoonful of sugar okay go for it okay helps that's the medicine Do you like it? It's really seductive. Like it's really silky. Mm-hmm. Dang it, I need to give me some more. Oh my God. <laughs> seductive and silky. No, silk, I, I mean, it's just a lot smoother than you think. Yeah. Like, but see, the thing is, it, it, mm, it looks, like no, it, you don't get like no more. Like no it. more for you. <laughs> no, um, but my whole thing is, even just seeing it, this is my first time seeing mm -hmm. it, it is a lot runnier than I personally would like a nut oh, butter to be. When you knead and squeeze, it is quite a viscous peanut butter knead type thing, but I mean viscous, you guys know what I'm saying, I but know. this is like liquid. Like you just pour that into, well, you know, because so, all you need like, is it shakes. No, you're supposed to knead I and I think it would have been even more liquidier. If I had not knead and squeeze, oh, you know, so. Correct. 
Yeah. Okay. So what is your tier on that? I liked it. I say two. I would definitely say two. Yes. Okay. Good yes. to know. I would drink this as soon as I can. <laughs> oh, no. That's pretty funny. Okay. Uh, penultimately, something that I am excited for you guys to try. High low. This is a cheese and nut snack pack. Uh, that I just recently started seeing on Instagram. And oh. I was like, OMG, uh, these look delicious. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, lo and behold, boop, Keto Crate. And I was like, how did Hi. you know? How did you know, Yay. Keto Crate? So um, this is crispy cheddar cheese and almonds. Like, those oh, things those. just sound delicious. So oh, I'm annoyed. I'm use annoyed. The spoon again. No, don't use the spoon again. Ooh, Ooh, I can't the way you use both hands. No, you don't mean you pour them. You don't need poofy. both hands, but they are big and poofy. They are big and poofy. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead and give them a try. Mm -hmm. Here we go. I'm just gonna try one of each. Yeah, no, me too. I'm gonna separate them just to look at almond first. Oh, so roasty. Mm -hmm. Roasty. <laughs> I like the flavor of the cheese. I mean, it's is very... it like moon cheese? Mm, yes. yes. Okay. It's Absolutely. Very, it's mm -hmm. very flavorful. That's Very good. Strong cheese flavor. Yes, it is. Not overpowering. Strong. Oh yeah. I, I figured That's it was gonna wonderful. be just that, you know. The crunch is good. wonderful. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. wow. No more. I'm just reading. Okay, it set it down. Set it down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, what are your thoughts? I'm gonna say the tier. I mean, it's close to tier one. I mm -hmm. really enjoyed it. Because, like, if you're going on a hike, you might need a snack mix like that. Or leave them as a little trail. <laughs> trail mix. To get, ow! <laughs> that was my <laughs> bare skin! <laughs> I, mean, I mean, shut up! <laughs> See, this is what I get for trying to be fashionable. I get smacked on my bare skin. <laughs> no, finally, oh we are gosh. having something that I am most excited to try. Mm -hmm. An item I didn't know existed. This is keto. This is Kiss My Keto uh, Keto Cookies, a Ooh. butter flavor. Oh, so, so, like, I haven't had one. a cookie in a while. I mean, mm -hmm. here we go. Oh, my God. After sunflower seeds and... Oh, and, mess. And, and, Why and those tips? Oh, y'all are both a mess. How about Ooh. that? No. Ooh. Stop. I'm heading everywhere. <laughs> okay, guys, this is this is my family. Okay, so we're gonna smell it. We're gonna smell mm. it. Mm. Can we smell it? <laughs> she said we, got, we are. We got none of those smells. Her nose is the only thing. I ah, so these cookies look weirder than I thought. Go ahead and grab you one. They're not as like uniform as the uh, high key cookies. I mean, just you in grab case. two. Just in case. Mm, they smell like they do smell like uh, those bag of cookies you get at the store. So there you go. Okay, go ahead and mm. give it a try. Ooh, yes. Mmm. Mm. Oh, it's so what consistency. Okay, so I'm really interested to know your thoughts on like the erythritol -y taste, because you know how. A lot of the cookies, the, the mini cookies mm -hmm. that we try have like an erythritol cooling effect. Mm -hmm. What is the flavor of the butter? Like, is it okay to be called butter? And then what is your yeah. erythritol? Like, okay. what is your cooling effect? Yes, okay, so butter, I, I do definitely taste, it mm -hmm. does have a good strong butter flavor. Okay. Uh, not overpowering, but good flavor. You describe everything right. as not overpowering. I mean, you know some of that stuff that you be eating, it's like slash of, like that mint toothpaste. <laughs> that was overpowering Chocolate stuff. So only say it when it is overpowering. Okay. You don't have to say when it's not overpowering. Okay, it was a very subtle. Oh movie. my gosh. <laughs> so, so, so No, subtle. stop. What? Why are you talking like that? Okay. Oh so, my okay, God. I loved it. It was buttery, delicious. It did remind you of like almost one of those macaroons. Oh my yeah. gosh, that yeah. sounds yeah. delicious. That's the name I was oh for. my That's gosh. The she it. I cannot wait she to try that then. Yeah. Oh my yeah. she saved yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Follow those woes. If my chair had wheels on it, <laughs> I would have <laughs> slid out of the picture. <laughs> You're right. I'm just gonna. <laughs> <sighs> Okay, you guys. Okay, give me your tears. Let's wrap this up because I can't. I can't do too much more, yeah, you guys. Well, you know what? Funny you should one. mention that because not only could you buy them, but you could buy them with a ten percent off uh, coupon. Because I have a code with Kiss My Seriously? Keto. Yes, it's listed right here. 
And go order those butter cookies. Apparently, I can't oh, wait man. to try them in September. Oh, I'll tell I'm you that. Definitely gonna try. Them. Delicious. Mm, super, super Butter, jelly. Yeah. You saw them enjoy the items in the keto crate. If you want to just go ahead and buy your own keto crate and sample these items, you can use the link in the description box below to get ten dollars off your very first keto crate, or. You could just win one for free, like right now, you know? Yes. I know, right? If you commented on my unboxing video, you were entered in a drawing to win a free keto crate, and uh, we're gonna announce that winner right now. A ton of Congratulations. Like, I cannot believe you won. I am so jealous. At this rate, you will have tried the items in the keto crate before I will have tried the items in the keto crate, okay? So like, let me know how you like them. Send me an email to watchautumnketo at gmail.com with your address and I'll get this thing in the mail. Okay, well guys, that wraps it up because I've had enough of them, okay? <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna call it an evening, but thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly full days of eating, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, and smash the crates. Exactly. The occasional product review, recipe, date night, etc. Thanks for hanging out with me and my family, and we will catch you next month. Bye! Scooters got a scooter! No! Oh my god! I think I need you guys. Oh my god. We gotta go. We gotta go. No, no, no. We gotta go. You are not nailing the sampling part of this, okay? We are sampling all the items. You can eat these right. later. Alright, do we disperse the water on the side? Oh yeah, go Here ahead. Here is your water, my lady. Oh, uh, who's your lady? Oh, that's okay. I'm so glad you guys are here right now. And uh, I'm not eating any of those snacks. Okay. <laughs>